Luke, uh, another good workout for the boys today? Very good, I thought um, Biggles Wade put on a good show first half especially. They had good shape out of possession. Um, they're a good side, finished seventh in their league last year. He's recruited uh, a couple of new bodies that he feels they're going to be strong this year. So overall, very, very good exercise. And pre is all about fine-tuning uh, your squad, but how pleased were you with today's performance? Um, some of the pitches that we're trying to set out, uh, the patterns of plays we're trying to set out, um, I thought they, they, they played ever so well. I felt there were some bits of details that need to improve, uh, but defensively we, we look sound. Uh, offensively, I think we can fine-tune a little bit more in the detail in the final third, but it's our second game. We're just over 17 days into a pre-season, so nah, at, the, as, at this stage, we're happy. And it was a, a step up in quality from Tuesday, but again, uh, controlled possession and dominated the game. Yeah, I think, um, in fairness, I felt that Tuesday was, was a good exercise, but today I felt that it was a little bit more realistic to a game. Um, they left a couple of us in the heaps, they played a little bit more back to front, so it wasn't as testimonial feel to it was, as it was on Tuesday, but I felt the introduction of Ryan Johnson giving us a bit of balance down the left-hand side. The second half introduction of Bradley Satch and Benno, I felt that they led the line superbly. Um, so now, again, overall very happy. And uh, despite the performance and the result, it still looked like we were still pulling in second gear with plenty more to come. Yeah, and it, it looks like that, Grant. I felt that they've not pulled on their reserve yet. I look at Bill's way going in at the half, they had hunched shoulders, their arms were on their hips. I felt our boys were ready for a second half straight away, which is pleasing, but I expect that. There's a golf in the level. Um, but the boys have worked hard and worked tire tirelessly in the two weeks that we've had them, and I think they're going to get their fruits of the labour as, as the games go on. And you mentioned uh, Ryan Johnson, who have been on the season on loan from Steeples yesterday. Um, gave him 90 minutes today. How pleased were you with him? Yeah, obviously, um, I know J Ryan from previous, and obviously he had a, a very successful spell at St Albans uh, at the start of the season last year. Like I said before, he gives us a balance. He, he's got a natural, lovely left foot that he's got every club in the locker. He can drive it, wrap it, drop it in. So I felt that his introduction today was pleasing. Um, obviously, it's going to be tougher in the National League. He's going to be occupied, pinned, and he has to change his game as much as what I want him to in terms of not fighting the forward as much as he possibly wants to. But I felt for a first display, I was very happy. And uh, from his previous spell with us, he's certainly come back bigger and stronger. But as a whole, the squad looked very fit, strong, and uh, and as a big and a big side. As a whole, you look out when they're walking out alongside Biggles Wade. We had five to six, six foot, six foot ones, um, and likes of Steve O, Paul Benson, Champ, Kieran Murta, Ryan Johnson. There's size across the pitch, but um, I think fitness-wise, I think this is the fittest that the group of players I've had, especially um, the luxury of going down to Barnstable for a week has helped. We, we squashed in probably about 11 sessions, which is roughly a three week period for us. So to have that contact time with them has been very, very productive. And I felt today you're seeing the fruits of our labor in terms of the movements, the patterns, the little passenger plays. And I'm, I'm looking to fine tune that as the week goes on. We got Wingate on Tuesday, which I can imagine is going to be a tougher test. They got a lovely pitch. Um, so I, I fully expect the boys to be putting another display like that with good habits. And there was a number of notable performances again today. Um, but it must be pleased for Bradley Sack to get his first senior goal. Oh, a superb finish. I've got to be honest, it was a hard finish on the up and he's finished it on the full. So he's a goal scorer, Grant. So in terms of that, he's come from the academy, he's worked ever so hard and he's now getting a chance. And I, I think him, Frank and Cuba at the minute are doing a great, great service for Cameron Moyer, Charlie Hunt, uh, the Pace Academy. So now, very pleased with the three of them. And uh, you mentioned Wingate on Tuesday. Um, we go there for our third pre-season friendly before uh, hosting Luton on Saturday. Yeah, obviously um, another tough test away from home. I'm going to still stick with the same shape. Um, it's something that I really want to fine tune. And I think that there will be a difference come Luton. I don't think we can play that shape against a full-time side, uh, a league above. So. I think you'll see a difference in our style of play come uh, the Luton game, but I'm very much along the lines of I want to stay with what we're doing at the minute, trying to fine-tune that detail so come the season the boys know their jobs inside out.